Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. So as you can see, uh, I've been moving on with my Blood Angel build and uh, I've made some progress uh, since last time you saw them. Uh, they've more or less 99.9% .9 complete now. There's only one thing that these chaps need and that is decals. Um, my decal sheet, I lost it. <laughs> I have no idea where it vanished to. I'm sure my daughter might have took it and done something with it. But... Uh, I have no idea where it's gone. So my friend Tiberius uh, is trading me the dice in the Dark Imperium box set for his Blood Angel uh, decals. So it worked out pretty well. Um, so yeah, I've started and more or less finished on the bases now. Um, I just need to like neaten them up. You can probably see a little bit of black in some places. I'm going to put like some little shrubs on there and stuff like that. But you can see like if I get really zoomed in. The bases, uh, I went with the, like a desert kind of effect. Um, I think it turned out really, really nice. Uh, I did a base color of Xandri Dust underneath, and then I used this texture paint here called Agrelin Earth, uh, and it worked out really, 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 really well. I think it contrasts the models uh, very, very nice as well. So this is the Lieutenant, uh, who's Amila, and then we have the Lieutenant, oh, just nearly not that guy. Then we have this Lieutenant here, uh, which is the ranged uh, Lieutenant, Lieutenant, however you want to pronounce it, sorry. I'll, I'll do it to both markets. And of course, my ancient... Now, this guy hasn't got a backpack because I'm still painting the backpack. Um, but you can see I made this guy very, very uh, nice and standing out on the battlefield. I know you can take a power fist, if I'm not mistaken, with these guys, but I went for the rule of cool. He looks cool, so I'm taking it. So that's how it is for this guy. And of course, I've got my captain in uh, Gravis Armor. Again, all the base is all done in the same effect. I changed the head in there to a Blood Angel helmet. I thought it looked a little bit cooler. Um, the the eye sockets, I love that soul gem stuff. You can get the eye sockets. It really makes them shine and mirror makes them cool. Again, with a sword, that is a custom sword as well. Uh, that is, I think it's from the Sanguinary Guard set. I just chopped that off and green stuffed it on and stuck it on. I thought, again, it looks a bit cool. I did that purity seal on there. And yeah, he looks pretty cool. I haven't actually added the backpack to this guy because I actually like this guy without the backpack. I know it may seem odd. But I really, really do like the guy without the backpack, so I'm really debating to just leave the backpack off because I think it looks uh, way cooler uh, than it does with the backpack on. Uh, but that's again, that's personal preference. Uh, we've got a squad of intercessors. Like I said, there's so many incest stuff now in Space Marine. In incest this, incest that. So uh, this is the sergeant. Yeah, he's got his helmet on there. Uh, he's got some nice seals on his gun. More or less completed, just... Uh, again with the bases these have all got the same base you can see what I mean like nearly done the bases I have to like redo stuff like that where I have missed because it is a huge pain uh, again over here we have the hell blasters this is a hell blaster sergeant let me just try and get in focus come on camera work uh, there we go so all the barrels are all drilled out as well which I know a lot of people were saying, draw out your barrels, Varak, so I draw out my barrels. This is the sergeant, because he's got the skull in his helmet. Again, I think it looks very, very nice. Again, with the same base, they're, they're, they're all going to be based like this. Um, but yeah, that was. this is just like a little update. What the main thing for this video is, is that I decided... Let me just move all these to one side. Brothers, we are being moved. I've decided to do another Legion, or do another chapter. Now you probably say, what again, Valrak? I'm I am gonna come back to Blood Angels, but I'm gonna come back to Blood Angels once they have their codex out. because uh, at the moment I feel like I'm gonna miss some stuff out if I start doing some more Blood Angel stuff. So I'm just gonna wait until their actual uh, codex is here before I start progressing with them. So what does that mean? That means now that I am moving on with a, another chapter. So I've ordered a ton of stuff, right? I'm just I'm I'm just gonna have to just show you these like this because I can't all fit it on my bloody desk so we've got the librarian and the captain which I just shown then we've got the the apothecary we've got the chaplain we've got a 10 man squad of reavers holy emperor we have a primaris redemptor dreadnought and the good old saying is why have one when you can have two so i'm having two of those because they are gorgeous looking models i absolutely love them and of course i have to go with the primaris aggressors as well 
And again, the good old saying, why have one when you can have two? So two boxes of Primaris Aggressors. And, oh, where is it? There it is. Lastly, let's see if I can fit this in. We have the tank, the Primaris Repulsor tank. I really should try and zoom this back a bit, but I can't where my camera stand is. So we have the tank there and stuff. That is all the stuff I ordered while I was away on vacation. And it uh, all came while I was away, except the tank and the chaplains. They came a week later. And to finish it off, we, of course, have the glorious Space Marine book for all the glorious rules. So you're thinking, what chapter are you going to be doing, Valrak? Well, the chapter I'm going to be doing is going to be the Executioners. Sons of Dawn. Very, very fun chapter. The... I won't say they're a Forge World chapter. I think they were established before Forge World, but they didn't have any law. Forge World actually made the lore on them. Uh, the, like I said, a gene seed of Rogal Dawn. Uh, best is, the best way to describe them is they're kind of loyalist world eaters. They chop people's heads off and have skulls and stuff and as trophies and all that kind of stuff. Fafnir Rand was their main guy back in back in the day. He was the one who founded the chapter. When all the chapters and stuff split. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to be doing executions. I've got some decals ordered. I'm hoping they'll be here for next week. So the next video I'll do will have a test model for my executional force. Uh, all ready to go. But beside that, chaps, I haven't really progressed anything. I know we, I took these guys to Warhammer World uh, right before I went on vacation. And I'm not going to lie, uh, I got absolutely slaughtered. Because I just had no transports. I couldn't move these guys up the field without getting... Uh, torn apart it just by the time i reached the enemy i didn't really have a squad left so it was i was just said to myself i'm just gonna wait till i start getting some vehicles and stuff now so i can uh be you know actually before i actually do a, another match and stuff so now that i've got all my vehicles and stuff uh, they're gonna be painting it up as executioners and once uh, the blood angel codex comes out i'm gonna jump back onto the blood angels and buy a little bit more stuff probably i'm gonna buy a uh, uh, a dreadnought for them and stuff like that. Now I'm hoping that the Blood Angel Codex will have some cool Primaris Bl Blood Angels models, maybe like a sang uh, a Sanguinary Priest, uh, uh, Primaris Marine and stuff like that. You know, something cool. So that's why I'm not really uh, pushing forward on the Blood Angels at the moment. Anyway, that is me done. I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you've got any comments, any feedback, anything at all, any advice, if you know how to pay executioners or anything at all that could help me out. Please let me know uh, if you've liked this video. Again, please let me know. If you hate it, please let me know. Um, but until next time, I uh, hope you all have a great day. And I shall see you all very, very soon. So thanks, chaps. And I shall see you later. See you now. And bye-bye.